Representative of Western Tigray, Buruh Zafaru, says Amhara expansionist groups carried out demonstrations on Monday, forcing ethnic Tigrayans to rally on streets alongside the newly deployed ethnic Amharas and claim Amhara identity without their consent. Berihu called the demonstration unacceptable as it consolidates the already started ethnic cleansing campaign. <laughs> The demonstration was tricky. It is known that hundreds of thousands of ethnic Amhara settlers have been deployed to western Tigray. It is these settlers that rallied for demonstration. The Amhara expansionist groups also forced ethnic Tigrayan residents of the area to go out for demonstration without their consent. These Tigrayans rallied in the demonstration for fear that they would be imprisoned, killed or tortured as usual. But most of the demonstrators were recently deployed ethnic Amhara settlers who have been allotted houses, farmlands and properties that belong to Tigrayans. The rally was deliberately planned by the Amhara expansionist groups. According to the representative of the area, the demonstration that was carried out on Monday is completely wrong as it reinforces the ethnic cleansing campaign by the Amhara expansionist groups and said it should be corrected. It should be noted that most of the people who showed up in the demonstration were the nearly deployed ethnic Amhara. There were also ethnic Tigrayan residents of the area who rallied without their consent. The purpose of the demonstration is to maintain the forcibly taken Western Tigray under the control of the Amhara region. This is completely wrong. They are making another mistake. They have continued committing mistakes day in day out. It should have been corrected, but it hasn't been corrected yet. Buru also stated that the demonstration shows that the Amhara expansionist groups haven't accepted the Pretoria Peace Agreement yet, and what they are doing is against the constitution, and the international community should take corrective measure. This act is out of Pretoria Peace Agreement. It is against the agreement. This is being done by the Amhara expansionist groups in a deliberate and planned way. And this shows the Amhara expansionist groups haven't accepted the Pretoria Peace Agreement yet. Therefore, they are pursuing their expansionist mentality. The international community should know this and take corrective measure. Western Tigray is constitutionally defined territory of the Tigray regional state and the people of Tigray who have been forcibly expelled from the area. The representative underscored that the campaign by the Amhara expansionist groups to make the constitutionally defined Western Tigray part of the Amhara region should be immediately stopped. He called the federal government and the international community to take corrective measure on the illegal acts in Western Tigray. The federal government should stop this madness. The international community should also not these. What Amhara forces are doing in Western Tigray is more than obvious to anyone. It violates the peace agreement and the right of certain community and extended the genocidal campaign on the people of Tigray. So the federal government should stop this. Giving media coverage to this illegal act is wrong. There is no legal ground for invaders to rally and claim that a constitutionally recognized territory of Tigray is theirs. I say the federal government should stop this.